Alright, this is my third Moab on the same map, this time with FMG9s. And if you couldn't tell, I just prestige because I don't have Scavenger Pro yet. I don't know what level I'm in I'm at, but apparently I wasn't playing at the beginning, but now I am. I'm playing with Super Duper and he's first infected. Huh. I could have sworn I saw Super Duper over there a few seconds ago. Anyway, the story really isn't about the commentary. The story is more about like fun track stories that we've had. So I live in Oregon, you know. It's not really exactly the most sunshiny place in the world. It rains every other day, so when when people ask me the last time I saw the sun, I'll probably most of the time I'm like, well, last time I saw the sun was probably a few weeks ago, and they're like, yeah, you would, because you're gay. And, you have no life. And I'm like, no, because I live in Oregon. I'm going to facts straight. So, yeah, we live in Oregon, and some track stories. We sh I don't know. I don't know why I got track stories from Oregon. Anyway, I remember this one where the, we have a train trussle route. We have a train, there's a one train track that goes through our city, and it pops around like five, five different places through our city, and it's in a straight line. And so, we decided to run on the tracks one day and just follow it all the way out to this bridge. And there's a, there's like an overwatch, not an overwatch, there's like, yeah, an overwatch where you can just look down and it's probably, it's probably a good 60 feet drop. And so we decided to walk over it and just, uh, just like view from up there and then there's another, there's another like place below it that's probably 20 feet below it, so it's still a 40, 40 foot drop into like really, really shallow water. So you'd probably like break your legs or die if you fell. But you probably wouldn't die. You'd probably like break one of your legs or both your legs or something. But, um, so yeah, we decided to go under it, and that was probably one of the stupidest things I've ever done because. There's there's these poles there every like 20 feet or so where you just have you just have about a like a bendable piece of wood like it's probably it probably barely holds our weight and you walk on that you pretty much balance it's like a balance beam balance for 20 meters and then you just get onto the pole and the bridge itself is probably about 100. 100 yards. No, about, probably about 60 yards. And so we balanced all the way across that one time. And. Wow, I already got my mug. Anyway, we. It was just. It was fun, but I'm probably never going to do that again because it was really dangerous. And. I like my life. But yeah, there's my Moab. Ended up killing my teammates and myself, so I kind of feel like an idiot. And I probably should not have put it there. But anyway. So, yeah. That's one of my track stories. I'll probably have some more track stories soon. But I love track. We do so much good stuff during track season. It's just so much fun. I recommend doing track if you're like... We do distance track, though. So it's more like cross-country practice. I don't do cross country though, but yeah, I don't know. I don't really know where I'm going with this, but I have some more track stories. About probably takes about 30 seconds though, so I don't have much longer to have. Oh, I guess I don't have that much longer at all. So yeah, there's Small and Mighty getting the final kill. Do I have Mach 5 yet? No, I have Surgical. Oh, Surgical. And I'm seventh, seventh prestige when I got my third Moab, so you know, good times, good times.